Okay, so here is an instructions, a step-by-step -step guide in how to build a rabbit. Um, okay, you can use it for just about a lot of different animals, but use your, your imagination. But I'm making it for a particular for rabbits. So here we've got four pieces of wood here. We want to join. These have been cut by hand, mind you. So we want to join this here, okay? We want to make life easier. I don't need to, to do all this, 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 but I'll show you step-by-step -step instructions how to make the life a lot easier. I can go straight into hammering this without the trouble of doing this. But it's best, even for me, it would be best to do this. I've been doing this for me, boy, so, you know, it's very simple for me that I don't need to you are showing you here. I don't need to jump crank this together, but it's, it, it works best even for me as well. Okay, we come in here. We we'll put a cheap clamp here. Okay. We want to put a three-inch nail here. A lot of you, you need a three-inch nail here. Well, a two and a half inch nail, sorry, or three inch, two and a half will do the job okay so we look for our other uh mate i've got to get organized here here it is my other um g crank make sure this is flush here and bring this here and the reason why we put these here is so we can have room to um hammer this okay so we just check make sure it's flush here now it's flush it try it more okay try this more so now we've got a vice here to it here it's perfectly these now here is what you use about that size you put one right in the middle here Okay. Okay. It's moving. So we might need, if it moves, a lot of times it does. You might put another one here at the back. Make sure you hold it. Loosen a bit, okay. Make it flush here. You feel with your finger and tie it. You come in here. do is you get a one inch nail sorry uh, what size is it um, um, you want um, okay okay that's the corner there okay corner there in your start of your project get a one inch nail And you bring it in here this way, okay? So it doesn't move. This two and a half inch now is enough to hold this wood, okay? It goes more than halfway into this second wood here. The one and a half inch now is so it doesn't move. It's not going to do that anyway if you lock it in place otherwise as well. But um, just to make the, the job a lot easier, we put another one on the other side here, on an angle. This 
should be fine. Okay? So we do that until we have a square. Okay? So we'll do that off, off camera and get back to you in a, in a little while in the next video. So I'll repeat, we'll do all, four, all corners there like this so it can become a square. Okay? So I'll show you. We, we, we want two of them. Okay?